guys, welcome back to this channel. So in a previous video, we were playing the thank you game with the pom-poms, remember? The thank you game, thank you. Remember like, oh, thank you for playing football and thank you for the beach, it's so nice. And thank you for singing, it's so much fun. All those things that you love in your life and they're so important to you, you are thankful for, yeah? I'm thankful, I'm thankful for something, yeah? Okay, and you remember that this game is a game that you can play with your family or with your friends for Thanksgiving. Remember Thanksgiving? We also learned about Thanksgiving in another video, yeah? Okay, so let's continue. So far, we've seen the places and the activities that we are thankful for. Let's continue today with the three remaining pom-poms, yeah? Whoops, I've told you, I was gonna ask you how many pom-poms am I holding? And I just gave you the answer. <sighs> okay, so. Let's pretend, okay? How many pom-poms am I holding, you guys? <laughs> How many pom-poms am I holding? Three! Yes! Ooh, that was so difficult, right? <laughs> okay, so how many? Three, yeah? Okay, so let's see. Which one am I gonna pick? Which one am I gonna pick? Ooh, this is the pink pom-pom. The pink pom-pom represents, do you remember from last time? People. Okay, so let's have a look at the people in your life. So we have examples here. We have parents, parents. Mm -hmm. Then we have siblings, siblings. Hmm, this one might be a little difficult. Do you know what siblings are? Siblings? These are your brothers and or sisters. Brothers and or sisters. These are your siblings. Mm -hmm. So let's repeat. We had parents, parents, siblings, siblings, or you can say brothers and sisters. Then we have grandparents, grandparents, Friends, friends, and pets, like a dog, a cat, a hamster, a rabbit, a snake. <laughs> Some people have snakes. So pets. Okay, so pets are not people, right? They're not people, but they can be part of your family, right? So we're going to include pets here. They are not people. Pets are not people. Pets are not people. You repeat. Pets are not people. But they are family, right? Okay, so we're gonna include them. All right, so let's see. Hmm, this is hard. Which person or pet is most important to me. Which one is so important that I want to go, oh, I love you so much. I am so thankful for you. Thank you for being here. Hmm. I'm gonna say I'm thankful for my parents. I'm thankful for my parents. Yeah? because my parents gave me life and they took care of me as I was growing up, right? And they're taking care of you also. So my answer, I'm thankful for my parents. What about you? I'm thankful for, I'm thankful for, you decide, my parents, I'm thankful for my siblings. I'm thankful for my pet. I'm thankful for my grandparents. 
I'm thankful for my friends. Which one do you choose? Yeah, very good. Very good picks. I like them too. All right, let's move on to the next category. So we're gonna take this one out, right? Left. This is the orange pompon. And the orange pompon stands for things. Things in your life that you love so much and you are so thankful for. Yeah, you go, thank you, thank you. So, okay, what things? So here are a few examples. You might have other ideas, but here are a few examples. Books, video games, games, bike, food, music, TV, computer, and phone. Okay? Okay, so let's see. What is the most important thing to you? What are you most thankful for among all these things? Or maybe other things, other examples. Let me think. I'm gonna say that I'm thankful for books. I'm thankful for books. I love books because you can read them, right? So it's entertaining, it's fun. And also you can learn so much in them, right? So they are fun, but also they teach you things. So my answer is, I'm thankful for books. I should also be thankful for food, I guess. Food is important, right? You need to put something in your belly. <laughs> But okay, I choose I chose books. What about you? What's your pick? I'm thankful for I'm thankful for Ah, yes, very good pick. Very good pick. I agree. I agree. Okay. Last but not least, we have the purple pompon representing celebrations and holidays and events such as my birthday your birthday but you're gonna say my birthday christmas thanksgiving we have to include it here right the summer holidays and anything else that you might be interested in, okay? Maybe it's a concert, maybe it's a class that you attend. Whatever is important to you, whatever celebration or event you enjoy, you can include it here, okay? So let me think. I'm gonna go with the easy answer here. I'm thankful for Thanksgiving. <laughs> I am thankful for Thanksgiving. Thank you for Thanksgiving. That's a lot of thank to give, right? What's your answer? I'm thankful for... I'm thankful for... Okay, very good, nice. All right, so you see this game, you can play it with your family or with your friends. All you need are either pom-poms. If you don't have pom-poms, you can use a die and each number represents a category. Or maybe you have some beads or anything else that has different colors or different numbers and you can play and you can play it several times once you've said i'm thankful for thanksgiving the next time you get celebration you need to say i'm thankful for christmas you cannot repeat thanksgiving you see 
So you can play this game with your friends and family. Let me know if you enjoyed it, if they enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up, please, because that's how we let everybody know that the video is good and more people are gonna enjoy it. Please subscribe to receive more videos in your channel. And if you want to see more videos, head over to my webpage. I will leave the URL in the description box. See you very soon. Bye.